While coronavirus changed the way many places operate, one group looking to move past COVID-19 is the Clinton Public School District. And today, well, the district welcomed back half of their elementary school students. Now, this was the scene at Eastside Elementary as students made their way to class for the first time since March. The district's elementary school students were split into two groups, Team Clinton, who started today, and Team Arrow, who will start tomorrow. District spokesperson Robert Chapman says because this split between hybrid and traditional learning is new for everybody, they just want to ensure all students can learn and get a quality education. Everybody learns a little different. You learn maybe audio, maybe you're a visual person, maybe you're kinesthetic. You've got to build and you piece things together. The same mindset has, has gone into planning these uh, hybrid, in-person, and virtual learnings. You can't just have one type of lesson. And our teachers have done a fantastic job of piecing together different ways to teach different students. Seventh through twelfth grade will stick to virtual only starting next week. And speaking of schools, Governor Tate Reeves didn't hold a media briefing today on the state's COVID-19 response, but did say via Facebook there will be an announcement regarding K-12 through schools having extracurricular activities. We'll have that announcement on air and online tomorrow afternoon.